All right, we are here with a historic artisan game. Um, yeah, I have all my mana, um, and I have expressive iteration and some removal to stay alive. This looks good. So this deck wants a lot of red. Uh, I, I'm playing a uh, Jeskai history. Um, it's a Jeskai control deck. Um, this this deck wants a lot of red. Um, you you don't need that much blue. Um, mostly for counter spells and expressive iteration. So I wonder if my opponent is going to play rogues again. Um, Art Artisan has a wide format. So here I'm going to name white. Oh wow. Fairies. Um, so this might be ninjas. It might just be blue, mono blue. I'm still gonna play out my tap lands. Take one damage. Okay, he's not gonna play anything. I'm gonna play my cards. <laughs> So here I don't quite want to iteration yet. Um, I don't really want him to land a threat. And he passes, wow, okay. Siren Storm Tamer. Okay, I got his creature off the board, very nice. So here I will play iteration. Just keep digging for cards. Okay, Reconstruct History is good. Um, I have enough tap lands, so I'm just going to take the mountain. Ooh, he has the Cutthroat. That's quite good. Um, so I, I, I can't really double spell here. I mean, I, I could do Rip Apart into Flame Sweep just to kill this, but I don't think that's worth it. Um, I'm just going to name White here. And then I'll probably cast out on his end step. Oh wow, he has another Brineborn Cutthroat. Actually, I'll cast out on his uh, draw step, or his upkeep. Um, I wonder if he's going to save it. Oh, Fading Hope. Okay. That's quite good. Um, so he gets to protect his creature. Huh. Hmm. So Mono Blue is a hard matchup, of course, um, being a tempo deck. Um, so I have six mana here. I am going to Sahili. Um. And I will pass. So he's probably going to play Brineborn. Yep. And here I will Flame Sweep. Um, so he could buff one of his creatures, or his Brineborn. Okay, yeah, he does. Um, so that one gets to survive. Oh, wow, he's attacking me. Um, so I, I am going to rip apart here, hoping to kill his thing, but he can play anything and it'll grow big enough. Um, yeah, he has the counter. Um, I could pay, and I think I will. Um, and then I will play history. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna pass. Um, Cause so, 
I, I'm gonna pass here because if he kills my Sahili, I can just bring it back with history. Um, but if he's not gonna kill my blocker, I will block. Great. So I can play planes just to um, play around like spell pierce or something like that. Take a heat here and take an iteration. So not the best history, but I still draw two cards. And I will pass here. Just keep chump blocking his cutthroat. Okay. Fairy Seer is quite good. Just keep chump blocking. So here is a expressive iteration. Look for something. Huh. I don't think I need the other unholy heat. Um, I'm just gonna take history again and play out Kazmina. Let's see what I draw. Oh, that's the perfect card. So I, I don't need Soul Guide. So here I have blue red up, but I am starting to take over this game with my planeswalkers. That's fine. I wonder if he's going to attack me or attack uh, one of my planeswalkers. It looks like he's attacking me. Hmm. What do I want to do here? I, I think I will unholy heat this. Look at its dispersal. Okay, that's fine. So he gets to draw. He has one mana left. Um, so just gonna keep drawing. So I will sacrifice this and I will return his cutthroat. Gonna reconstruct history, get back the spell bomb, get back unholy heat, get back iteration, and just take over the game. Yep, and he forfeits. Yep. Okay, so he's playing uh, mono uh, blue. So I want um, my magic missiles here. Dovin's Veto. This is actually not going to be that good. I want Sunset Revelry and Disputes. Narset could be good, but I, I'm not really afraid of him. Or I, I should say, I don't really want to play Narset when he's already drawing cards through Curious Obsession. Because that means I'm behind on the board. And basically, I just always want to just keep his board clear as much as possible. Um, Soul Guide is not going to be good. Um, Wander is not going to do much. Um, let's see. Rip Apart is going to be slow, but I think I do want it. Um, I'll, I'll trim on Metamize Prophecy. Um, I think, I think I can trim on Kazumina, but that's a little bit awkward. Um, you know what, I'll, I'll trim on Neutralize. Like, using three mana to counter one of his, like, two, one mana, two mana, um, creatures isn't the best, and it basically opens me up to, uh, his own counters really heavily. Um, Sunset Revelry isn't great, actually. I mean, it'll, it'll get me creatures and life most likely, which is fine. Do I want that over like Whirlwind Denial maybe? For like a counter war? Metamize is also quite good, um, just for the consistency. Potion of Healing, that might be a bit too bad. 
I mean, I could bring in Cinderclasm. Cinderclasm is quite awkward though, but if I can get one of his 1-1s, one I mean, a two, a, a two, I'll take it a 2 for 1 for sure. Like, And even a 1 for 1 isn't that bad. Oh wow, he, he forfeits. Okay. 